Hello, hello everybody, I hope you're all good. Um, today's video is going to be about uh, our human system, so it's going to be 10 ways to boost our human system naturally. Pour les Français, n'oubliez pas d'activer les sous-titres juste en dessous par ici. Uh, I hope, j'espère que vous allez apprécier et uh, aimer cette vidéo, surtout avec le confinement et le coronavirus. So I hope you guys will enjoy this video. Um, with the lockdown and the coronavirus going around, it's going to be very important to be careful and to boost our human system naturally. Don't forget to uh, subscribe my channel, my YouTube channel, and to check my Instagram, my Facebook, because I give daily tips, get daily routine about food, um, naturopathy, all those natural ways to heal yourself and feel better. So let's get started. So the first thing to know is that uh, our human system is a whole system. So it's just not one organ working on our human system. All our organs are involved in the humanity. So we'll have to um, boost the whole body and not just one part of the body. Um, even if most of our human system is fine in your gut, in our gut, it's important to boost the whole body. And for that, a healthy lifestyle is very, very important. Yes, supplements will help us to boost our human system, but it all started by our lifestyle and what are we doing in a day um, to support our human system. So the first advice is to respect your own biological uh, clock. What I mean by that, uh, I mean go to sleep when you're tired, get up when you're not tired, eat when you're hungry all these kind of things. Do not get up at a certain time or do not eat at a certain time because it's the way it is. Just listen to your body and eat. For example, if you're not hungry at lunch, just get a little snack and then um, eat maybe at two or three in the afternoon. Just listen to your body. This is super, super, super important. And I want to say that the coronavirus lockdown is very good for that because we can actually uh, listen to our body better because we're in the house, so we can just do whatever we want all the time. So it's pretty good for that. The second advice uh, is to go to sleep as early as you can. So um, the hours before 12 o'clock are just like super, super important. They are going to regenerate, make your body way better uh, and boost your human system as well. So it's so important and uh, to manage to go to sleep early. Uh, the tips is to put an alarm very early in the morning and then the next day you'll go to sleep a bit earlier. I usually go to sleep at 10, half 10 and it's just like so important. I can definitely see huge differences, a huge difference on my health. So yeah, just try to do that. The third advice is to balance and boost our gut. So all our intestinal flora is so important to be boosted because as I said, most of our uh, immune system cells are in our gut. So it's so, so important to really cherish and look after our gut. Um, so the, um, there is few probiotic food, which is very good to give to your body to uh, boost your gut and make your gut healthier. Um, so the first thing is fermented uh, vegetables, so you can find, you know, like kimchi or even do them yourself and it's very good to eat them daily. Uh, you can add it on top of a salad or like, on top of a toast or anything really, but just try to get at least one tablespoon a day. The other thing is kefir, so I usually take water kefir, more than uh, the normal milk kefir because at least there is no dairy in it. Uh, so it's delicious, you can drink it like a lemonade or it's very similar to that or if you know kombucha it will be similar as well and it's just so good to boost your immune system. Other fermented drink is kombucha, kombucha is very good as well um, so you can make it yourself as kefir or you can just buy it in the shops um, and drink it you know at least like three bottles a week something like that. Um, like the small little bottle. Then you can as well eat tempeh. So tempeh is like kind of like fermented tofu, not really like it's fermented soya beans basically. Um, 
So you can just cook it with some soya, tamari sauce, anything like that, ginger, garlic. Garlic and ginger are very very good for you, you boost your immunity as well, so just do it, pan fry it in the pan fry it and it's very very nice. The other things is fresh bee pollen, so you can find them frozen, uh, when, I mean you order them and they arrive to your house frozen, then you can just put it in the freezer and take one um, teaspoon a day, teaspoon or tablespoon. Um, I know two French brands, Apicia, I will put you the description below, and Polenergy as well is very good, just put them in the freezer and that's it. Um, I try to look for a brand in Ireland but I don't really know them so if anybody know or have any recommendation just let me know in the comment but I find Robot, so Robot is meant to have frozen uh, bee pollen and bee pollen is just like amazing food uh, for our gut. The other thing you can get is sauerkraut, we call that choucroute in French. Um, it's very very good for your gut as well because it's fermented food and fermented food is total probiotics for our gut. And the last thing you can eat as well is sourdough. Ah, who wouldn't like to have some sourdough? I mean it's such a good food to have, of course don't take too much of it but um, just a bit of sourdough bread is very good and because of uh, the sourdough in, in it you have a lot of fermented bacteria as well. So that's all the probiotic kind of food you can add daily in your routines and in your plates. Then the fourth advice is sport. Move your body every day. Movement is just so important for your whole body, for your health and for your human system. I recommend to do at least three times a week sport. It can be some running, I mean jogging, it can be um, yoga, pilates, it can be intensive cardio session, it can be just muscle building, anything, swimming pool, whatever, but just move your body, even dancing, like you can just dance in your living room and that'll do it, you know, dance for like 20 minutes, um, that's just so important, so do it. The fifth advice is to manage your stress. Most of us nowadays are very stressed and can have anxiety. So it's so important to manage that. Uh, so I have done a video uh, about uh, stress, how to manage your stress. You can find it on my YouTube channel. Um, it's probably in French, but you can put subtitle in English as well. Uh, but I will just tell you quickly some advice now. You can do meditation. Um, if you don't really like meditation, you can do some yoga. You can do all the breathing exercising. So um, heart coherence is very good. You breathe in five seconds and breathe out five seconds three times a day, for example. It's only five minutes. You know, that will take you maximum 15 minutes a day and it will change your stress level, definitely. Um, you can as well uh, just do massage, take a good warm bath, you know, all those little things. Go into nature. Yeah, you know, all that stuff are very, very good to manage your stress and to feel better. Then the sixth point is to eat healthy. So eat healthy is the most, most, most important. What I mean by eating healthy, it's mainly a plant diet. Um, yeah, base plant diet. So just like it's mainly a lot of green veggies, uh, a bit of oily fish, um, a bit of meat, but not too much, a um, lot of seeds, a lot of legumes, you know, those type of food is very good for your body. As well, avoid any processed food. Uh, this is just empty calories and it's very bad for you. So obviously if you want to have uh, a nice kind of treaty night, you can have some, but just try to avoid it as much as possible. Then my seventh uh, tips is to eat, I mean, to drink bone broth. Uh, it's, it's such a grandmother remedies, but it's just like incredible. It's like an elixir for your uh, body and your human system it, and your whole body. It's just like so good. So you can do chicken bone broth, you can do beef bone broth, you can do fish bone broth as well. Uh, you can watch video on YouTube about how to make it. I'm not talking about, you know, the little broth that you buy like the knorr thing, I'm not talking about that. I'm really talking about bone broth that you made yourself. Um, it's full of collagen, it's, it's very good for you, very, very good. So just 
try it. it. It sounds pretty disgusting, but it's actually not too bad. You can add some celery, some herbs, uh, a bit of carrot, and it's perfect. And you'll have glowy good skin as well. So try it. The eight tips is to add a lot of herbs and spices to your uh, plate and food in general. So um, we talk about turmeric, we talk about ginger, um, garlic is very good to boost your immune system. It's very good as well to load on your inflammation. I did a video as well about that so you can go check it. Um, but it's so important. So just add it everywhere and just don't just add it as decoration, add it as full ingredients. You can add parsley, coriander, mint, all those things are going to boost your immune system and boost your whole body. Then as the nice ninth advice, uh, I'm going to talk about I'm going to talk to you about supplement. So supplement is the last things to do, but it is important. Um, so I talk about probiotic food, so it's natural probiotic, but you can as well supplement yourself in probiotic, maybe twice, third times a year. Um, they're very good to feed your bacteria in your gut, so to make your immune system better. Vitamin D is so important and a lot of us are lacking of it, um, mostly in Ireland, I guess, because there's not that much sun. Um, vitamin B as well, very important. You can find them. You can either supplement yourself, either, you know, find those uh, vitamin, vitamin B yeast. I'm going to show you that. And then especially for the gut, so it's not really for human system, but just for the gut in itself, which will have effect on your human system. You can supplement yourself in zinc and L-glutamine, which is an amino acid. Uh, those two things are very important to have a healthy gut. So, you know, maybe once a year supplement yourself with these two supplements. And then two things that are very important that I usually take during winter is um, grape, grapefruit, sweet syrup, grapefruit seeds extract uh, and echinophores. So I usually take 10 to 20 drops every day uh, during winter and it's just like magical. And it's very good for kids as well. The best natural antibiotic that you can give to them. Um, so that's about the supplement. There is way more, but you know, uh, that's the main important thing for the human system. And then my 10th advice is to be happy, to enjoy your life, to love your family, uh, to be loved. It's so important as well and has a big, big, huge impact in our health as well. So just be happy, enjoy your life, don't do anything that is making you unhappy. Try not to anyway um, and keep it smiling. That's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little video and that that can help you in this moment uh, where it's a particle or a moment where we all need to boost our immune system um, all year long because we don't know when this coronavirus is going to end and even after if we find a vaccine or even after that it's so important to still boost your immune system. Uh, so that's it. So much love to you guys. I hope you enjoy. Don't forget to like, comment uh, below if you have any other advice or plant or anything that you'd like to recommend that I probably forgot, even if there is plenty of plants uh, that we can talk about and plenty of other advice. I'll still be interested to read all that. Thank you very much. See you next time.